What's more fun than a trip to Wonderland? How about a visit to Texas in Wonderland, the theme of Texas Fest 2014? Here's Kathy with more. Cowboy hats have been part of Texas Fest tradition for all of its 35 year history. But at this year's Texas Fest, the cowboys sported a completely different look. Is that the Mad Hatter there with Alice? Yep. The theme this year is Texas in Wonderland. I love the fact that Joy Goodrum, who is the joy of Christmas 365 days a year, picked this theme. And it's gonna be big, bright, beautiful colors that are all about Wonderland and giving a nod to Texas. The Queen so of Hearts has spoken. And all through the Urban Convention Center, the Wonderland adventure showed up in everything from the decor to the jugglers to the acrobats, to costumes, obviously, and some great hats. Attendees tipped their hats to celebrate the 35th anniversary of Texas Fest, the brainchild of Irving Healthcare Foundation's first president, Pat Carnell. And in keeping with Baylor Irving's roots as a community hospital, the same volunteer spirit that started this event is alive today. My favorite thing about the event is the community coming together to help out others in the community. It's an important thing for the Healthcare Foundation to continue to receive great funds so that way they can help all these nonprofits in Irving that need help. And what I love is even the table decorations were made by the people of Irving. We had folks decorate these giant teacups that are filled with flowers. And uh, those, those are things that it's very much like the Texas Fest of old where you, everybody chipped in as much as they could. They also helped this year by shopping a Wonderland sized silent auction with everything from jewelry and watches to toys to spirits. What? Is that Texan for drink this? It was like sliding through the rabbit hole into a great party with a greater purpose. The proceeds of Texas Fest typically benefit the foundation, so we can do our work and write the grants and conduct campaigns and all, all the things that we do as a foundation. But some people do designate their gifts, and in fact we have almost $50,000 going to our expanded emergency department. This is the biggest fundraiser that they have in Irving every year. So. This is a great opportunity to do some great things for a whole lot of Irving neighbors. The evening continued with a live auction, a delicious meal, and world-class entertainment. We have Cirque Vertigo, which is the Walinda family, the Flying Walindas. They're here doing uh, their, their acrobatic show. It's a Cirque du Soleil style, but it's Cirque Vertigo show. a party this wonderful? Who would dare be late? This is Kathy Whiteman reporting. Baylor Irving celebrates its 50th anniversary this year. Visit HealthyIrving.org to learn about events planned for the celebration. Mm -hmm.